Hey guys, CivicKid96 back here with another shoe review. Uh, let's get down to it. Uh, it's the latest Kobe 7 that came out. I don't know why people went crazy over it, but I got my pair. Uh, again, shout outs to East Bay. Got through real easily. Um, let's get to it. It is the Nike Zoom Kobe 7 system in the circuit orange, medium black, silver colorway, aka the Cheetahs. First time opening the box. Left shoe, right shoe, and first initial impressions out of the box, you can see the, the print comes out real awesome in this, uh, in this colorway, um, definitely is a reminiscent of the animal, the cheetah, again the Nike 7 had a bunch of animals, aka the predator pack, um, the shark, the wolves, the uh, cheetahs, of course, and the poison dart frogs, of course, the what the Kobe um, combined all those together and threw them on. And uh, you know, it's people's personal opinions on that shoe. I have my own review on that shoe, you can find it on my channel. But, um, not like anything else that I've uh, reviewed already, so I'm not going to go into the details and aesthetics of the shoe. I just want to comment on this colorway that I just picked up. Um, again, like a, it's real, the print is real hit or miss. I, some people are just going to call it a fashion faux pas. I mean, cheetah prints for women, blah, blah, blah. But I see, you know, I think these things are pretty hot. Here we go. Here's little minute details. Here's the heel cup. If you can see, the cheetah has little spots, which was pretty cool. I just noticed that. Um, black bottom, again, half herringbone, half uh, sole pattern from the six. Copper fiber shank. Kobe Shinzoku and the uh, cheetah colorway, the orange, circuit orange, the gray, again, midsole. Again, the Play Fast series. Um, if you have, actually have a uh, Play Strong insole, maybe you can get it and, you know, maybe c combine it with the uh, wolf or whatever, that orange, and see how it pops. A lot of people are trying to talk about that. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do an extra thing here. I've never done a review, a single review on my. Uh, Kobe 7 uh, Christmas Cheetahs. But here you go. Here's the Christmas Cheetah in comparison with the Cheetah that just came out. Um, the Christmas Cheetah came out back in December when Kobe and them took on the, uh, I don't know if it was the Heat or someone else, I don't remember, but um, they debuted that night. Um, I wore these. I, these are real dead stock. Um, I haven't even worn them outside. I've just tried them on. As you can see, the laces aren't originally tied up the same, but they're still in dead stock condition. Spots there. The red laces, the green swoosh, the, the volt colorway. Here's the back of the shoe. Again, the uh, spots on the uh, cheetah slash leopard or whatever, you know, whoever they wanted to call the animal at the time. Um, this was a Supreme version, so it came with the Play Strong insoles, which I do have. I have everything in mint condition. Um, great shoes. I like how Kobe, every Christmas, since the Lakers play every Christmas, they have like a shoe that comes out for them. Uh, this past year, 2011, it was this shoe, the Kobe 7. Uh, 2010, it was the Grinch, the 6, that I do have a review on on my channel. And the 5 was the Chaos, which is a review I'll probably do sometime. I'm really into Kobe's stuff. Um, I kind of wish I got into them real early, but the, the farthest I've gotten back were... Actually, I used to have a pair of Kobe 1s, and I sold them, which I, I don't mind. I really didn't like the ones that much. But starting with the 4s, 5s, 6s, and 7s, I really got a decent amount of Kobe's. Um, liked them a lot. I mean, if you're going to pay 170 or 140 which which these are, for a pair of good stuff and good quality... Well, some of it's good quality, most of it is... Um, go with Kobe's, man. Uh, Jordans, you're just paying for nostalgia and uh, lower, less quality. So, there's that. And that was the review of the Kobe 7 Cheetah, both Christmas and recent colorway. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. And uh, have a great evening or day.